What's good, guys? We back here at the Real Software Podcast. We finna get into this Charles the White Whack 100 situation once again. So make sure you hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Apparently, you know, Whack 100 and Charles the White got into a fight last night, you know. And guess who was there to break it up? Motherfucking Michael Jordan. So when I seen this shit, I was like, how the hell are these three niggas get in the same place at the same fucking time? So, you know, we gonna watch this video, man. I don't know what the fuck Michael Jordan got going on, man. You supposed to be in a penthouse somewhere. I thought you was the owner of down. Um, the Jordan brand. He got plenty down prisons. Man, Michael Jordan living it up, man. Y'all sleeping on him. But whack 100, man. I don't know why the fuck you keep on trying to go at Charleston White. And you know he just gonna call the police. He said this in many of his videos. If you fuck with me, you threaten me in any type of way, I'm gonna have you arrested. So why is you guys coming up here saying on Pyru, on blood? They go, man, that's a plenty of fucking reasons for them to start up a Rico case. You just seen what happened to Sheen? Did you see what happened to Sheen? Sheen don't even... What the fuck Sheen got to do with killing and selling drugs and gang affiliation? These bitches sell clothes. So, you know, Whack 100 versus Charleston White. I got the video for you guys. Make sure you hit that like button, come subscribe. It's the Real Cause for a podcast. Let's get into it. Tonight, um, shout out to the adverb, uh, adverb or objective, whatever the weird name is, uh, verb. They showed me all kind of footage, just running around, getting chased, beat up, rubbing on a dog, some broad, and 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 Miss Hustle from Harlem, body this. I don't know why this talking about me. He got some other problems. See, I don't know, right, <clears throat> that the significance of Hoover's, I'm going to speak on it because I can, they was a gang that was Hoover Crips at one time, and they said, F that, we get into it with everybody, we dropping the blue rag, we don't red rags, we got an orange rag, we Hoover criminal, we everybody, we all thought these was going to get off for sure. Decades later, these is stronger than ever, so you know that... <laughs> Like, you know, that is a gang, that is a movement that whether you like them, you got to respect it. So what I'm about to do with this is crazy. But I need my red, my, my, my red flags, my blue rags. Pit so, you know, Whack 100 is still pushing, though, you know, this blood shit, which I have no problem with. You know, you are what you are in the community. But when you're doing it against someone like Charles the White, bro, Come on, bro. You not that's not tough. That's not gangsta. So do it against these bird bads. Do it against these other OGs who are on the same shit as you. Do it against people like uh what's the guy that be doing the interviews or oh, the real, I think it's a real production. He uh Terrence Gates the Real Williams. Terrence Gates the Wheels. Do shit beef with those guys because they're gonna have some shit for you. You know, y'all love beefing with Charleston White because he's half blind, he's a skinny dude who talks a lot of shit, and y'all just feel like y'all can sit up there and bully this guy. But you see, I'm gonna be here today to say this you wouldn't punch your uncle in the face, you wouldn't punch your auntie in the face, you wouldn't punch your granddaddy. So, you know, why, well, honey, why are you sitting here trying to beef with this old man? You know, I know y'all probably in the same age group but at the same time think of it this way bro this guy is disabled you punch this nigga one time in that one good damn eye it's over with bro so stop the beef with goddamn charles the white before your ass be locked up on the rico next you're gonna be just like goddamn sheen so you know hit that like button comment subscribe it's the real cause off for a podcast i'm out